Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome to episode 83 of the Old Dream Saves. They found our kryptonite, lads. A team has found our kryptonite, and that is Indra, our left midfielder, and then we don't really have anyone that's very good at backup. We have this young guy, Alex Page. It's not the worst. Don't look at the passing. That's double figure. That's just a typo. That's actually double figures. Um, yeah, <laughs> there's not much I can say about it. Is it? I was trying to, I was trying to find ways of. It's quick. That's it. Oh, that's all I got. Um, here's out for six weeks. I will be. Actually, no. We'll we'll have. We, you know, we don't need it in January transfer. We'll be back by then. Okay, Kieran Kelly's back. Oh, Junior Houston scored a free kick. You don't see many free kick goals in football manager this year's football manager. Um, but Houston scored one. I was quite pleased with it. Uh, blah, 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 blah. What are we doing, boys? Let's catch up on shit first, eh? Hey, hey, hey. We're through the FA Cup. Just about. Squeak it. We squeaked through it. So after the Bolton result, we drew with Carlisle away. And we beat them 3-2 at home. We're, it's like we're finely balanced teams. There's nothing it between us, really. Lee Madison there. And then uh, Houston with his free kick. And Tony Leslie with a brace. Which is good news. Because if we're like... We played them three times recently, and every game has been close. And they're they're battling for top of the league, so that's good signs. It does it means I think that we're we should be where we are. Our team is good enough to be here. It's not like we're a random run. I think playing them three times in quick succession showed that we're actually a decent side. All right, Chigozzi's asked for more football, so fingers crossed, everyone. Um, we've almost completed something. And that is the youth facilities will be done in a few days, which is good news. Uh, finances. Okay, we're above 200k again. We're above because we did get a little bit of money in the old FA Cup. A little bit of prize money, a little bit of uh, gate receipts and all that good stuff. Playing Yeovil. I have no idea where they are. They might be in my division. Oh, yes, they're in the division below. Okay, who's their key player? Voldemort, apparently. Yeah, he ain't bad, is he? Oh, he's on loanie. Okay, we've got a chance at the FA Cup third round then. That is massive. Because that will that what we were talking about last episode about selling the player could be a thing where if we can make get Man United away, then we won't have to. Well like, that's the dream. Stopping from selling our players would be would be lovely. Right. Where is Shrewsbury? Didn't even look. Shrewsbury, depending on your geographical location uh oh they're challenging as well okay and it's away from home all right good challenge lads alex page is looking nervous is that because you've barely played the season in your shit of football mate i imagine it so i'd be nervous if they chuck me on you know despite my you know obviously incredible pace my passing isn't the best, you know. When you're going at that speed, it's hard It's hard to pass because everything's kind of blurry when you're traveling that fast. You know, like when you're on a train and it's going really quick, you know, it's it's, it's tricky. But, you know, it's one of those things I'm just going to have to struggle on with. You know, it, I was born with incredible pace. Nothing I can do about it. Right. Go on, Shakespeare. Go on, Shakespeare. That's a poor ball, but they scrambled it away. Winners. And we've got enough men back here. I'm not too, too worried. <clears throat> no, a little bit more worried. Much, much more worried. Massively worried. Okay. I'll take this opportunity to ignore this goal and thank to um, a brand new Patreon. And I'm not sure how to say the name. Because it's either, it's either Plumber Smack or Plumber's Mac. I'm going to guess, oh, I'm going to guess Plumber Smack. I think he's a big Mario fan, and that's what he's gone with. Thank you very much, mate. And also, Kenzo, I appreciate it massively. He's been a um, Patreon for a while, and he's upped his, upped his pledge. So I really, really appreciate that, guys. It's weird. Like, I don't tend to talk about money worries, on this channel, I, I probably never talk about money worries on this channel ever because I I don't want I'm I, and I'll pre preface this by saying look preface this by saying 
I'm not asking anyone to join on Patreon or anything like that. I just want to explain how I how it weird it is being sometimes being a YouTuber is that obviously as the year goes on and people are watching less Football Manager and people obviously start um, ending their patrons, which is obviously completely fine as always, um, and it's happening to everyone and and. But that's, in essence, that's my wages. Oh, Jesus, that's good. In essence, that's my wages. And it's weird getting pay cuts every month. <laughs> and it'll probably be the same every single month now until the new game comes out and people come back start watching more content and stuff like that. And obviously also ad revenue's down over, like, each month the ad revenue, the view's going to be less, the ad revenue's going to be down every month until November now. So it's kind of like, oh, okay. It's weird. It's a weird situation. But like I said, I don't really talk about it because I'm not trying to guilt anybody into fucking donate. I'm, I know what a lucky position it is. I'm still making good money. And I, so I don't want to guilt anyone into donating or whatever. But I was just explaining my feelings. Because that's what we do on this channel, man. We talk about our feelings. All right. This game has been turd. So I'm glad I just kind of ignored it and chatted for a bit. All right, Hesketh, the one that missed the sitter. So, go on, hit it. Hit it. Ah, so lucky. This will drop us out the playoffs, won't it? Yep, yep. And that six-point gap there for Dagenham and Redbridge. Good tackle, Seaman. Right, long hoof ball, which doesn't generally work because we don't have any sort of target men. They're better. Those balls that like, beat the line. Oh, nice, nice. I'm liking it. I'm liking this. Decent. Hit it. Power. None. Chuck Norris. You can't beat. How are we supposed to beat Chuck Norris? He's the world's greatest goalkeeper. Right. Page. First time we've seen him. All right. All right I'll give you yeah, credit where credit is due, mate. That's a good. That was a good ball. Second time round. Page. Not bad. Oh. Well done, mate. I'll go, you know, got to big him up. And again. And again. Winners. Win. Ooh, ooh. Watch the run. There's only one man forward. Look, if, if we've got seven men back here, boys. Yeah, here we go. They look like a couple of Siamese twins jumping for that ball. My two centre men. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Siamese twins did well. And then... Anybody's a real mistake. It's a good pass. He went with him. A little bit slow, maybe off the mark. Is that Luke Garber? It's not. It can't be, can it? Yes, it fucking is. It's amazing the random players that you gain knowledge of through Football Manager... Leslie, Leslie, oh, he's Peter dinklage it, but again, Chuck Norris. I don't even know why we're playing. How do you even beat Chuck Norris? How can you beat Chuck Norris? We'll make, drop you back a little bit, but we'll send you boys forward. Okay. Just, I, won't, I won't shout him too much, just a bit of encouragement. Nobody's playing particularly well. Okay, Randall. Am I allowed to shout yet? Hesketh. Madison. Gone to the back post. Leslie, just keep it in. Okay, well, keep it in and then keep it. All right, Jagosi. Decent. Shakespeare. Into Leslie. There's the tackle. He's going to... Oh, on his left peg. It's a bit more tricky, that one. Hesketh missed a couple, though. That first one was... Horrific. Come on, boys. What is going on? <laughs> it's offside. Surely that's offside. Apparently not. It's a good save. Yeah, we don't look like winning this one, do we? we we're not really look creating much. Three. Come on, boys. Just one. Just one good move. And then they're going to panic. 
Alex Page is playing a six point. We could play a Pavsky there, right? I'm going to play a Pavsky there, but make him an inside forward. Come on, a Pavsky. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Watch. Okay, here we go. No. <laughs> right, here we go. That can't have been the highlight. That was a crap shot. Oh, it was the highlight. Excellent. Um... Uh... Chigozi's playing a 6.3. Good, good stuff. If you want more first-team football, mate, you have to be, like, play half-decent. And you'll get it. Come on, just give us a little cheeky one. That's not a nice sharp shop. No. No. <sighs> no, they're just playing it for... Oh, oh, here we go. Here we go. Come on. Come on, boys. It's going to take a bit of work. I'll just hoof it forward. We're good at that as well. Kelly, what you got for us? Shakespeare. Fucking hell. Okay, we got it back. Lucky. Oh, the passing's not great, is it? That was... That wasn't the best move I've ever seen. <clears throat> Come on, get a goal. Make it look like you tried to actually come back from this match. Okay, I was going to say that's a terrible free kick, but it's genius. A Pavsky! Oh, can't beat. Even a Pavsky can't beat Chuck Norris. He's just a beast. All right, hoofed forward. No. Oh, don't score a third. You've not been that good. Thank you. Oh, I appreciate it, right. <clears throat> They've probably just edged it, but it's been a pretty crap game all round. Yeah, this left midfield could be a problem for the next month. Because it's not like a little downgrade. It's going from League One to Conference downgrade. Apavsky's not left-footed. That's the problem. Um, I wonder if you have like any... Attacking left back. Maybe maybe our little uh, what's his face? Who drew a flip? Where is he? I'll took it I've taken him off. I've forgotten his name. Maybe he's the answer. He's a left midfielder in disguise. I'll have a look at him because you know I'm kind of desperate. I don't think it can be that much worse than the guy we've got, Alex Page. Madison. Go on. Just wait, just wait, and go. Not go as in fucking shoot from 45 yards, you fucking idiot. I didn't even think I needed to explain that. Go as in pass to the guy that's just made the run. Christ on a bike. <laughs> that was dreadful. <laughs> Love it. Like Hesketh. Like, that, like that's what I meant. Madison. We got two in the box. No, Chuck Norris is like, no, mate. No. Clean sheets all day long. We've looked a little bit better, but it's just... its that We've not created a great chance. Oh, look at this hoof pull forward. Oh, Seaman's done brilliantly there. And he's played the ball off. And Leslie... Okay. One, two. He's... Oh, what a save. Was that a save? It was a save. Chuck... It is Chuck Norris in goal. Oh, he's just end the game. Skip the match then. What's the point? What is the point of playing them? That was a wonder save. Oh, God. <laughs> you see the difference between the goalkeepers there. Mine's a oh, <laughs> fucking shittest juggler in the world, he looks like. All right. Just. <laughs> okay, one well, from the training ground. <laughs> Go on, Pritchard. He's a centre back. This is. Why are you there? Okay. Go on. Look, we've got so many people. For... What a terrible game of football this has been. I'm um, speaking from both sides. <clears throat> Go on, Hesketh. Ah, oh, it's a shot. We'll take it. Yeah, we were we were good the last twenty minutes. Just didn't create great chances. Just a couple of little scrappy half chances, but it is what it is. Right, let me check. 
I want to see if uh, Chigozi can play left midfield. Well, I know he can't play there, but has he got the attributes? Can we mould him into the next Ryan Sessignon? <laughs> He's, just, he's not that good just generally. That's the problem. He's got eight crossing, eight dribbling, and seven part. Okay, he's, no, he's, he's, he's not better. At least the other guy's got pace. He might scare somebody with some pace. Um, he's not... He's not really set the world alight, as he? Right, there we go, my friends. I hope you enjoyed that shit. Um, thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new. When is our FA Cup match? Because this is going to be a big one. Do we jump ahead? When is this? That's January. Yeah, yeah. We'll probably just jump ahead a few games now and uh, come back for Yeovil Town. When are we? What date is it? 14th of November. So we're like three weeks. How long is our left mid out for? Adkins, how long are you out for? Six weeks. Yeah, the math doesn't add up. Thank you very much, guys. See you next time. Bye-bye.